I had one of the most longest days I've ever had when detailing so far. Once I was done cleaning Joey's car, the BRZ, I literally went to San Jose, which is an hour away, and did some cars over there. I'm gonna explain soon, but right now I have to get a haircut by my barber. Shout out to him, George. Back real quick, I am finally working on Gina again. I'm restoring the headlights. All I did was sand. I need to take them off the clear coat. Another thing, I fixed my bumper so it mounts on good and how I want it. I'll show you guys that. She a slut, she, she gon' sum me up I keep a chopper in the cut Why, Watch me run it up I pour the lean all in the gun In my pocket, so big bust They wanna see me when I shine Bet they ain't show no love I told that bitch that she a slut She, she gon' sum me up I keep a chopper in the cut Why, Watch me run it up I pour the lean Guys, look at my car Oh my god No headlights It looks like it has eyeballs <laughs> But I'm about to clear coat my headlights. It is super clean. I love it. I still have to polish out this because he blended it, but there's still more like sanding marks. All right, this is what I have set up. I am clear coating the headlights inside because outside is like really cold. We'll see. I'm gonna uh, clear them out here, put them in, I guess you could say, an in incubator to cure. It's just a storage unit. But. It is way warmer in there than out here. Um, let's get to it though. Told that bitch that she a slut. She she gon' sum me up. I keep a chopper in the cut. Why? Watch me run it up. I pour the lean all in the gun. In my pocket, so big bust. They wanna see me when I shine. Bet they ain't show no. Hey, attempting to fix my mistakes. I'm gonna sand this down till it's smooth. I might need a wet sand actually. But you can see how rough it is just from the first go. It's just really hard to sand, like this though. Yeah. Got these all sanded down, put it back on. As you can see, there's no orange peel or any bubbling, or any sore. I mean, I could, I think I should sand more right there, but polish could. I think Polish will get it out, so we good. Told that bitch that she a slut, she she gon' sum me up. I keep a chopper in the cut. Why watch me run it up? I pour the lean all in the gun. In my pocket, so big bust. They wanna see me when I shine. Bet they know it's up. Looking so good for the meat. Um, I'm pretty proud of myself for pulling this off. Um, something I want to show you guys is how I put out my fender. These are aftermarket ones, so see how it's really close? I put washers so it like pushes it out. Although it like, I think it bends the fender a little or puts tension on it. Um, another thing, I use this tab. I moved it from here to there. And I'm gonna use a zip tie for here. What else did I do? Yeah, that's all that I did right now. Um, pretty much ready, I gotta put on the bumper, which is quick. Yes, we did it. Future Tyler here, and I want to talk more about that San Jose trip I was talking about. What had happened was I showed up, I had two people to do. I started on this first G, but found out that one of his headlights was already clear coated and I sanded it down. I didn't sand all the clear coat off. I was going to see how it turned out, but I ended it. I ended up spraying over it. It turned out horrible, and 
I learned from my mistakes to sand the whole thing. Probably gonna have to do this again. Shout out to Jose and Christian. Christian's car, it was a black Volkswagen. He, had, he was in a similar situation, so we got um, a more harsh grit to sand off the whole clear coat. I mean, it wasn't, I think it was a film, a protective film over it, I don't know. But we sanded that down, got it done, and sprayed over again. What I don't like about the clear coat method of restoring headlights is that it doesn't per turn out perfectly smooth. In order to do that, you would have to wet sand and polish again, um, which is a lot of work. And I've been doing this on the side for a good two weeks. I think it is not worth it because there's just too much of a liability at hand. The headlights can turn out horrible if the conditions aren't right, which most of the time it isn't because I'm in San Francisco and it is cold. You guys found that out when I did my headlights. I did tons of headlights and when it came to mine, I messed up really bad. You could see how bad it sprayed on. That was the worst it had ever done before right before um, the eliminate me but i got it done on time i literally woke up so early to get it done before the meet at 10 a.m made it there on time everything went great you'll find out in the next video when i go to week fest so that's pretty much all just be aware of clear coat when you're restoring headlights it might take more time than if you were to polish down the plastic instead of the clear coat. I think that's what I'm gonna do from now on when I detail people's cars. Today's video is interesting. I think it was. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for the next video.